whole thing's been very, very exciting. Oh, yeah, that, that, that number will be great for the kids. Lost Horizon's a marvelous book, you know. It's hard to believe that James Hilton wrote it oh, nearly 40 years ago. Every word is absolutely applicable to today. I guess that's really because we're looking for the same things now that we were looking for then. You know, that mm. hope for a better world. Yes, Shangri-La. So you and Hal have it in the soliloquy. Having found it, could we believe it? Or would we choose to go back to the world as we know it? Yes, and that original description of the world as it is intrigued uh, Ross Hunter, the producer of the picture, Hal David, myself so much, that we felt that uh, we just had to do this picture. Oh, I'm sure, yes. Do you remember the High Lama speech? It's very... I look at the world today. Is there anything more pitiful? What madness there is, what blindness, what unintelligent leadership. A furiously racing mass of bewildered humanity. Strengthened not in wisdom, but in vulgar passions, crashing headlong into each other, motivated by greed and propelled into brutality. The time must come when evil will destroy itself. And when the day comes that the world begins to look for a new life, it is our hope they may find it here in Shangri-La. Chance to live forever is really no illusion. <laughs> 